Okay. Hey y'all. Yes. I am back. Um, I just... The past two months have been some really great months. Um, I went back to Europe. Um, after like seven months of not seeing my family, I finally got to see my family. I got a bad sinus infection. I felt like, like my face was being ripped off. But I am back and I'm back in um, a good space, headspace, and I'm back with new clothes to show you guys. So I'm so happy for the ones who have sticked around and wanted to uh, continue to see my videos. So, you know, like I just said, I just came back from Europe and I found Primark. Uh, we, I don't know if we have any in America. I don't think we have any in um, Missouri, but they have really good prices, like better than H&M. And I was like, Girl, shoot. So I decided to get some and I am so happy to show you guys. So I got some lingerie and I got some PJs and um, I know this video will probably be, who knows, maybe it'll get age restricted, who knows. But if you really, um, you know, like my content, thank you so much. And make sure you follow me on Twitter, Snapchat, Instagram, and all that stuff because I'll keep you guys updated. Period. Okay, so let's get into it. This also is from Primark. Um, I love wearing robes around the house, you know, while I'm naked. Because it just feels so good. And I just feel like a bird, like I'm free. My booty is free. You see? My booty is free. Hey, my booty is free. Everything is free. And this is really comfortable. It's not scratchy. It's not itchy. I've probably watched this a million times, so like the former glory that it once had, it's not, it's not really there anymore, but I love it. Um, and now let's get into the stuff, baby. <laughs> okay, y'all. So this one is probably the one that I'm like really most disappointed in. Um, all my family, they keep talking about my little hood and stuff, but I got this in a size extra small, but I wish... Okay, in regards of it being good for pajamas, like not trying to be, you know, sexy, perfect. You know, it has the looseness, you know, whatever. But in regards of like me wanting to feel like, uh, I'm not getting that va va voom. Like, it could have been a little bit tighter in this if it was going for like, you know, Mm, like you know like that but it's it's all right and it does feel nice it feels nice in this area it's actually really soft material i don't know what it is it's probably polyester you know most companies nowadays they just make polyester it's cheap people like it even though it kind of gets worn out fast but here's the front here's the side and here's the back and yes, I am wearing underwear. This is some underwear that I got from, um, where did I get this from? I got this from, I forgot, but yeah. So if you're out and about and you're trying to have a pajama party and you're not that confident about your belly and stuff like that, put this on, put a little bit of sexy underwear and be like, you know, Okay, so let's get on to the next piece. Bonjour, mon chéri. I don't know what that means, but um, <sighs> sorry, I just got done twerking to Megan the Stallion. I love Megan the Stallion. I <sighs> was just trying to. <laughs> Anyways, this set is so cute. I believe this is a U.S. size 8 and 10, and I definitely could have sized down. I don't got big tatas, so... Oh my gosh, it's raining so much, and I wanted to go with your chicken wings. <laughs> I'm still get it, though. Period. <laughs> Period. Okay. Anyways, um, this set is just so cute. I definitely should have sized down because the tatas are 
about to spill out you know if i bend like this but this is overall cute like i said a million times but i wish i could actually make the string tight like but i can't it just allows me to tie it but that's about it but this is adorable great for um you know just wanted to be cute and stuff because i do like to be cute being sexy you know that's one and all but being cute is just you know, I feel like Ariana Grande. But they said Tiffany's in bottles and bottles. Now something like him didn't enjoy. Okay, anyways, here's the front. Here's the side. And here's the back. <laughs> yeah, so cute. This is really good for, you know, if you want to get your twerk on, you can get your twerk on with this. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. Next piece now. <clears throat> so guys, realistically, if I'm going to bed, most likely I'm not going to be wearing like super sexy lingerie. Usually I'm naked or if I'm around people, I'm just going to wear a big oversized um, shirt. So this is something that I would definitely wear. And since I was in Europe, I was like, I need something that says bonjour, of course. And you know, Mickey Mouse or Minnie Mouse, she's just so cute and adorable. And I just couldn't pass this up. And I knew that if I went to like Disneyland or Disney World in Europe, girl, that shirt would be like a hundred dollars. And huh, I'm on some frugal shopping over here. Period. <laughs> Look, y'all, now every single thing that I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say period after everything. But yeah, I love this shirt. I definitely have worn it already a few times. But, you know, if you're trying to be a little sexy, sexy, here's the front, here's the side, and here's the back. You can always, you know, <clears throat> hit people with the surprise. Bam, bam. So this set that I'm gonna be showing you guys, um, it came with this um, panty and it came with two panties and this bra. So I'll just turn around. So uh, it's kind of sheer in this area, but uh, this has like jewels on it. And I just thought it was so nice because I would see something like this at Victoria's Secret for like probably a hundred dollars at least for the set. And Victoria's Secret is just so overpriced and overhyped. And now I completely understand why I was so close to being bankrupt. But um, we not talking about Victoria's Secret, even though I like to include my disdain for them on every single haul. But uh, yeah, this is in a 34C. They did not have any D cups, but I did find out that um, I think 32D or 32DD is the 34C is the sister size. So um, this bra is okay. I definitely would not wear it every day. This is definitely something that you would just wear, you know, when you just want to be sexy. Um, I don't have a lot of boob spilling out of this, which is great. Um, <clears throat> I typically like to wear bodysuits now because I'm trying to work on my, you know, little Tony. But um, this is in a size medium and it's really, really, really stretchy. It does not fit me. I definitely need this in a size small. So here's the front. Here's the side. And here's the back. I did pull it up because if I didn't pull it up, you will see my butt crack because it is more of a full back and it will show my butt crack because it is sheer. But <clears throat> overall, this set is okay. Would I buy it again? If it was on sale. <laughs> okay, so let's get on to the next piece. Okay, so this is the last piece, guys. And I love this one the most. I feel like it's very form-fitting without being not without being too overly tight. I feel like it's perfect. I believe that this is a size D. Um, naturally, I'm a size 32 double D. I know I don't look like it, but I certainly am by Victoria's Secret standards. Oh, girl. But um, I love this part of the um, bodysuit. Like, I have a lot of bodysuits like this, but I love how it has this part um, because it really, you know, gives the illusion that my waist is just snatched, okay? So, um, 
and I feel like I don't get too much side booby. I feel like this is a pretty good fit and uh, when I went to um, Primark, I did not try any of the clothes before I bought them because <sighs> it was so busy. It was so busy. But um, here's the front, here's the side, and here's the back. And I, I love the back because it is higher up and I love the lacing detail here as well. So yeah, um, this was sheer and all in all um i definitely will probably buy pre-mark lingerie again if i do happen to go to europe again which i do think i will in the future um me you know i, I like asia a little bit more but uh i don't know if asia can handle all these assets just kidding <laughs> but um i love you guys so much and have a good rest of your day and i'll see y'all the next go bye